Hi guys. In my previous video, I have shown you how to install Odoo 15 in Windows. Today, in this video, I will show you how to create a website by using Odoo Website Builder. But before jumping into the web page creation and design, let's understand how to create a website on the Odoo platform using the Website Builder tool. We just The Odoo Website Builder module comes as standard on the platform and the user can avail of the application by installing it from the application modules available. So if we go in applications, here we can see, if we just clear these filters, we can see that if website module has been installed or not. Let's check. So if we can see here, <clears throat> the website module has been installed in my machine. If you have not installed it yet, you can install it by just click install here and then it will be installed. Once it will be installed, you can move in the main menu and in the installed application, you can look here, website. You can select the website module in the menu on the left side of the screen as shown in the uh, in this video and from the menu you can select and install the various additional modules of website operations required moreover if you need to know more information about any module you can avail of the module info option available with each module to create a website for the company or for yourself or for any company, you can select the settings menu from the configuration tab of the dashboard. So if you can go here in website and then click on configuration and in websites, here you can see all your websites. And if you want to create one, you can go in settings. Once you come in the settings page, here, you can see here that already there are, uh, there are the websites. And if you want to create a new website, you can click here. By clicking here, it will open this page. On selecting the Create a New Website option, you will be presented with the menu depicted in here, the website name, website domain, website logo, and company that should be functioning details should be described. On the Odoo platform, a website can only be used for a single company, even if the platform is used to manage multiple companies. So let's create a website. So, so if we just give a name to this website and website domain, any domain if you already have got, you can just give, or if you don't have any domain, you can just leave it empty. And you can put any website logo. So let's choose a logo from here, which I have saved. A company, you can just, I have already saved a company, Odooistic, and default language is English here. From here, if you just click pick a theme, all the themes installed in your machine, you will be able to see here. So if you want, you can pick any theme, but I also want to tell you here, um, before choosing a theme, you can click on live preview. So this is a live preview of this Baptic theme. If you like this, you can just start now. Or if you want to choose another theme, you can just click on choose another theme. So let's suppose this one, live preview of this theme VGC. And we look at uh, this Andalusia theme. If you want to use it, we can start now or we can choose another theme. So let's choose this theme, use this theme. So it has started making our website. It's very simple, isn't it? 
once the website is created, you should initially add certain go-to options for the website to function on a basic level. To assign certain basic options, you can select the settings menu and under the website tab, a description of the website can be added. Furthermore, the website can be made to run along with company operations. In addition, the domain of operation along with the language used on the website can be added. I'll just tell you how we can do that. If again, we go in our website, and from here, we can click on configuration and settings. So if you can see here, there are a couple of options we can choose for our website. We can also pick a theme from here in the similar way which I have already shown you how to pick a theme. So you can also pick up theme from settings and then configuration from here. You can also give a name to your website. So here, there are two websites at the moment. So my website, so I just choose the website which I just created. And from here, language languages section, there is already a language coming here. But if we want to install a new language, we can do that. The record has been OK. So if you can see here, all the languages, famous languages are here. So any language which you wish to install for your website, you can do that. Here, you can configure your domain for your website. And you can also give links for your social media contents as well. Twitter, Facebook, GitHub, LinkedIn, YouTube, Instagram. And the pictures related to these social media contents also will be there. If you click this option, specific user account, it will allow you or uh, the users to create an account per website, which only permits visitors to continue once they have created a user account on this website. Another one is the cookies bar, which can provide you with a customizable cookies bar. The user can configure this one. You can also click or activate it or it's up to you if you want to activate it. In addition, so social media integration can be enabled and links to distinctive social media accounts on Twitter, Facebook, GitHub, LinkedIn, etc. can be added. Moreover, a default social media share image can be provided, which will be displayed on the website. If you click here, default social media, social share image, then you can just choose. If you have saved any image, you can also configure that. The website's configurational tools are depicted in the following uh, way, if you will do that. So guys, this is a very simple process to create a website by using uh, Odoo a Builder. So in my next video, I will just tell you how to manage pages, how to add different contents, banners, and cover pages, how to add links, and how to customize the website. Thank you so much. If you will like this video, please give me give like and subscribe this channel as well. Thank you so much.